What's up guys, welcome to my next video. And this video is gonna be a um, Goodwill uh, that I got, uh, it's like an update. I went to Goodwill today and uh, I got a few things. <clears throat> uh, two VHSs and uh, a few DVDs. And I go once in a while, because sometimes when I go there's nothing there. So, you know, it's my day off. So, uh, I wanted to go and see, check out what, what was there. So, frankly, I actually found some stuff that it was actually pretty good. So I got the bag here. Um, and I just want to show it off real quick. It's like an update. So I hope you guys enjoy this. So the first one I'm going to get <clears throat> that I got was um, a mask with a share. Uh, I have this film already, but in a newer condition. But this one's like in an older condition. It's from uh, MCA Home Video. And I got this because of the older, uh, the older case of it. Um... This is a really sad movie. It's based on a true story, and it's really, really depressing. If you haven't seen it, check it out. Um, it's it's super sad. And here's the tape. Really old. That's why I got it. So that's number one. And number two is uh, my second VHS is uh, Frida with uh, Summer Hike. My wife loves this movie, so I got it for her. And I saw it, and it was pretty, actually pretty good. I mean, she did a good job. Um, as a Mexican uh, uh, painter, artist, and I was surprised that I found it on VHS. I didn't know they had it in VHS when this movie came out, so my wife was actually excited when when I found it in VHS. So we're probably gonna see it again. And there's the back. There's the tape. It looks really like a new condition. Um, uh, where's the trying to friend? I think that's the print dates over here. I'm not even sure. Um, whatever. I mean, if you know the print date, if you know the print date, just let me know. There's too much numbers on this. I don't know which one it is. And um, Space Jam on DVD. I really like this film. I mean, I grew up watching this. I have the VHS, the VHS of it, but I need to get it for DVD and maybe one day in Blu-ray. So right now, I just got it in DVD. It was cheap. Uh, it was, it was, you know, it was two bucks. So. And, and it was in a good condition. I mean, it's a little well. That's my uh, fingerprints. So there you go. This is a Space Jam. I can't wait for the new one. And uh, Whitaker Limit. This movie is really underrated with Chris O'Donnell, Bill Paxton, and rest in peace, uh, Scott Glenn. It's actually a pretty good movie. Uh, he's in the mountains and he's trying to save his sister. So I got it because you know I saw it at the theater a long time ago when it first came out. And it's really underrated. Not a lot of people have seen this. There's the discard. And when I saw this, I like, I know, why not? This, you know, it was, it was cheap, so I got it. And this one I didn't get it at the Goodwill. I actually got this at the Dollar Tree. Uh, it was nearby, so I walked over, and I found this, the Possession Experiment. Uh, it's a blind buy. I haven't seen it, so you know, it's a dollar. And there's some movies I bought from Dollar Tree that's actually pretty good. I mean, you. If you haven't seen my video about the Dollar Tree, go ahead, go back to it, and you'll see the the stuff I got. And there's the back. I got it because of Bill Mosley. When I saw him, I'm like, you know, I'm a big fan of Bill Mosley. You know, he came on the Devil's Rejects, House of Thousand Corpses, Three from Hell. So that is uh, the Possession Experiment. Uh, and the last one I got, it's actually my favorite one. That. That really got. I was surprised. I found is the the box set of the Naked Gun. I'm very a big fan of the Naked Gun. It's really underrated. I mean, uh, may rest in peace to uh, Leslie Nielsen. He was such a great comedian uh, when he did Airplane. And I finally found it in a box set. It's actually pretty nice. And I'll give it around. There's the spine. Here's the back. I don't know. Somebody wrote wild on this. I know. Yeah. You know. That's how you find in the Goodwills. And here's the back, the same picture, and the cases. I'm gonna show you the cases. Okay, here's uh, part one, which is a classic. If you guys haven't seen it, check it out. Really, really funny. And number two, uh, Nigga Gun Two and a Half. I smell fear. I already remember this one, so I'm gonna you know give it a watch. 
I remember part one and part three very well, but part two I haven't really seen it. I think I did, but not as uh, as much. It's fine. Here's the little gift card. Uh, I, I like this to make fun of ghosts. And the last one. This one I actually do remember. These used to uh, show it in HBO back in the day when HBO had really good movies and less channels of it. Only had one HBO in that time in Cinemax. So, Naked Gun, three and a half. Yeah, final insult. I like the original cover arts. They're used for the DVD, in the VHS now, they use the antique tape. But now they have uh, different cases and Blu rays and so on. I don't really like the new designs, but there you go. There's it. So, that's the last. I saw three of them. I'm going to put it back in here in the box, which the box is actually in good condition. I got it for like $3, so. Not, my, not not bad for you know for the whole case and let's put it here so there you go that's the upgrade of uh, update on the VHS's I'm sorry on the VHS and DVDs on Goodwill so you know if you're in Goodwill go check it out I mean you know I hope you guys find something really great so yeah that's my update and hope you guys enjoyed this video i'm gonna do some more videos so thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video you guys take care